Hi, uh, can we just, um, just want to check that we're going to, the order of the list is going to run as expected? Yes, this is, we haven't changed it. We're going to do the, um, this little baby with coarctation first, is about three months old. Um, she's also got severe aortic stenosis, so we were a little bit more worried about her, so we put her first. And the second one is um, a, a, a child, straightforward child, pulmonary stenosis. Um, is everybody uh, happy? Yeah, I'm happy uh, we got enough stuff to carry on the two cases. I'm nervous. <laughs> uh, this is Mary Jones and her dad. Brilliant. And uh, we've got actually all the uh, checklists, they're not always been fine, there's been no problem at all. It's good. I'll just sign that in. That's great. And um, Dad, can we just check the obvious? We've got the right girl for the right procedure. Okay. Um, so this is Mary Jones. Yes. And the date of birth is 26th of June 2008. That's correct. And what we're going to do today is repair her coarctation aorta, -E and that's your signature. Yes, it is. I agree. Fantastic. Good. Okay. And can we just check her? Name oh, it's all in her foot. I think. Okay. okay. So we've got Mary Jones. Yeah. Date of birth 25th of the 6th 2008. Yeah. And her number is 838-644. Yeah. That's right. Great. And has the surgeon drawn a little line on her? I believe so. It's um, here. That's under a head drain. Right? Brilliant. Okay, that's great. Jolly good. So I think we're ready to complete our signing. We've done the consent form check. We've checked the surgical site marking. We've checked our ward checklist. Um, Dad, is she allergic to anything as far as you know? Not that I'm aware of, no. Great. Okay. Um, Hannah, have you um, uh, checked where the blood is? Yeah, the blood's in the fridge, four units. Fantastic. Um, and Christy, the anaesthetic equipment check? Yes, it's all checked. Can we carry out the time out, please? Yeah, okay. Dr. Walker. Um, so just to confirm, this is uh, Mary Jones, and her date of birth is 25th of 6th, 2008, and her number is 838 and she's for a pair of coarctation and it's been signed by her father. Um, so from my, my point of view, she's a three-month-old baby, she's got severe coarctation, she's also got um, uh, aortic stenosis. My concerns are that when we relieve the coarctation, she's going to have problems with her coronary perfusion um, if her blood pressure drops. I've got some more adrenaline ready and I'll just have it to hand. Um, she um, hasn't um, had any problems so far in the anaesthetic room, which is good. Um, she's had antibiotic prophylaxis. Um, yeah, so that's my main. Okay. okay, so um, this little girl has a, a, a coarctation. We're going to do a left thoracotomy. Um, that's marked and we checked the marking this morning with the family and in the anaesthetic room. Now I'm going to go through the fourth space. Um, the coarctation itself is pretty straightforward so I should be able to do an extended end-to-end -end repair. I think uh, uh, in addition to the noradrenaline we may need some blood as well because it's, uh, at that point there will be some significant vasodilation so we should probably have some blood in the room. Professor Elliot, I've got all the instrumentations for the core patients and have no concern about the instrumentations. Okay, so do we have any um, imaging available for this patient? Yes, the, we've got a really good uh, echocardiogram which is uh, up on the uh, computer in the corner and we've reviewed that this morning to make sure everything is alright. No? I've given the antibiotics in the answer room. And we all know each other, we've got no new team members in the room today, have we? No. I think with this child in particular, it's really important that if anybody feels that there's something not right, um, the, ch the child's got very little margin for error, so please keep an eye on the monitors. If, if I'm concentrating on the operation or uh, if Isabel's got a ventilatory problem, everybody else, please feel free to speak. I don't want you to be quiet if there's a problem. Can we complete a sign-out check now, please? Yeah, okay. 
Sister, are all the swabs, needles and instruments correct? Yeah, the swabs and needles are correct. That's lovely. And was there any specimens to send with this patient? Not for me, no, no. no. Okay. Were there any equipment issues or adverse incidents that we might need to sign a, fill a form no. out for? We're fine, no problems. No, okay. everything's okay. The equipment's are up to date and they're checked and correct. Fantastic. And what are the post-operative plans for this patient? Uh, yeah, well, we had that interesting bit of ischemia, didn't we, um, when the clamp came off, but um, everything's much better now that the, um, the pressure's back up again, so I think we'll send it back on a tiny little bit, little bit more dry.